Welcome to Gnosis Connect. Today, we will be going over a few of the everyday features in the system, starting at the admin level. As you can see, the admin has a sleek, intuitive dashboard with all the key features only one click away. Let's start with adding a course. First, we'll give our course a name. Let's call this Employee Health and Wellness. We'll leave our course type as online and our enrollment classification as elective. Now, we push Save and Continue and we can upload our content. To upload our content, we simply push Add Assets. We'll name our asset and give it a brief description for our learners. Then we set our type based on the file that's being used. Now we push Upload and we simply drag and drop our file into place. Push Save and it's loaded into our course. We can add as many assets as we'd like to a course, as well as forms and surveys to get feedback from our learners. Once everything is loaded, Publish will make our course available for enrollment. From the Enrollment tab, we can enroll departments, teams, and individual users to our course. Just push this right arrow, add an end date, and our learners have been enrolled. User management in Gnosis Connect is a snap. We have the traditional departmental breakup, and on top of that, we have our unique Teams feature. Teams in Gnosis Connect are unique because they can be specific to a department or run across different departments. With the ability to have users in multiple teams, we're able to deliver specific content to learners based on parameters like job title, experience, working groups, or location. InfoPro Learning has partnered with OpenSesame to bring a content marketplace into Gnosis Connect. Within the OpenSesame marketplace, you can browse their entire catalog of 20,000 plus courses. Once you find the course you're looking for, you just select your preferred billing method, your number of learners, and add it to your cart. After all the desired courses have been found, you can check out and add all of the new courses to the system catalog without ever leaving Gnosis Connect. Let's check out the powerful yet simple reporting available in Gnosis Connect. As you can see, there are 10 pre-built reports to choose from, getting you any information you need at the click of a button. We're able to sort reporting by all kinds of different parameters, as well as see a quick chart displaying the overall status. Let's take this a step further and see how our blended course is performing. Again, we're able to see visually how the enrollees are tracking as a whole, and if we scroll down, we get more information on where each user stands along the path to completion. After the all reports in those connect, I'm able to print, save as a PDF, or export to CSV. If I click on a user's name, I drill down into their individual learner report and can view their entire learning history for as long as they've been with the company. Now let's look at the system from a learner's perspective. We see across the top, we get a good look at what we have finished, have in progress, haven't started, and the total number of courses we're enrolled in. Let's take a look at what's in the not started section. From here, we simply click on the course you'd like to take and launch the first asset. Our SCORM course works and looks great. It also keeps track of where we left off last in case we didn't finish. Learners have much the same reporting features available at the admin level, however it's restricted based on permissions. This user happens to be a team lead and has a few extra reports available to her that give her insight on how her team's performing. If we click on the overall course credit report, we can see a full transcript of everything this user has done. They're able to take that report and deliver it to their manager or keep it for themselves. And that concludes this short demo of Gnosis Connect LMS. Thank you for watching.